Ma? Ma, I found Pa. Now, Lucille, dear, didn't I tell you those people were friends of mine and not to worry? Well, I didn't know you'd be gone all day, now did I? I don't mean to fret, but if you just disappear like that... Ah, Ma, I'll be in my room, okay? Call me when dinner's ready. Yeah, they're gonna have an argument, so I'm gonna go sit in my room with my headphones on and blast emo music. Because why not? So this is my room. Wow, this is kind of interesting. I know that there are three hint coins here, and there is also uh, an item. So let's have a little bit of a look around. So there's one hint coin. There is nothing. I used to be in my own room again. I could finally read that book. But then I'd have to stop mid-chapter or something. I hate having to stop it. What else could I do? Get a bookmark. Hum, hum, ti tum. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Weren't you and Dalston arguing over some old indecipherable map the other day? Might have feeling quite curious. Rattle must be getting through to me. Boring thought. Still, imagine if we really did discover an ancient artifact. That would be terrific. Herschel! Herschel! Did it ready? Oh, did he? That was quick. No! The same coins in there! The same coins! He's gonna get the thing coins! No! School was dull. I wanna go get my hint coins. School was dull. And I don't care about fencing. I just wanna go get the hint coins. <laughs> Damn it, game. Uh, I don't want pudding. I want to. Can I eat my pudding in my room? Well, okay. <laughs> I told Randall I'd meet you after dinner. Is that okay? We're just going to sit in Randall's room and talk. Oh, that's not how things are going to end up. We all know that. I want to go back to my room. Damn it! Thank you. Oh god, I'm back in my room. Thank freaking god for that. <laughs> Let's get more hint coins, please. Oh, a puzzle. You know what? That's a bit of a bonus. What on earth? There's, there's a puzzle here, hidden here. <sighs> Fine. <laughs> How the hell did they hide a puzzle is a very good question. What is this? How did they hide a puzzle like this? Pokem totems. Were there like totems like in front of the dresser drawer or something? Okay, they must have been like in one of the drawers. I don't even know. I don't even know. So I don't even know. Who's responsible for this mess? Each of these columns should have been three blocks high and have a totem bed on top. They had to arrange from left to right in this order. Yellow, blue, green, red. You can never hit the top block in a column. Think carefully about which order to hit the blocks in. So what, it was... yellow... Oh, okay, I... this is... interesting. So it needs to look like yellow, blue, green, red. So what if I, like, knock this? And then knock uh, this, and then knock this, then knock this, and then no. <laughs> Wait, how many have I left there? If I can't. Oh, I can do that. Okay, fine. <laughs> but let me do like knock all of these, doesn't it? Yes. No. Maybe. I don't know. Can you repeat the question? I know, I know, Dave, I know. Hide the text. No, what the hell's going on? Hide the text. Dave, I'm not asking to do that. Why can I still punch things when all the text is up? Why? Why is it designed like that, of all things? <laughs> like, really now? It's just weird. Oh, I can't wait, no. What? How do I move the red one? How can I ever move the red one? Or the yellow one, for that matter. No, wait, I can... I can do the yellow, I need the blue one, but, like, how would I move the red one? Uh... Because if I, like, poke one out, like that one, that's just going to drop down. Like, it's not gonna... Huh? Wait, no, is there something missing here? I, I don't even... I don't even. This doesn't honestly seem all that possible, considering, like, I don't really have any way to... Shut up, laptop. I know you can't... I know you have no power for that sake. Uh... How? That doesn't move. If I move that out, it moves out. This makes no... What? I need to put something on top of it so I can move it to the right? Well, well, let's try something here, I guess. Let's try doing this. How? No, I can't get something on top of it. Uh. How would I go about getting something on top of it? I guess I could do that. Oh, I get it. Oh, 
that took me way too long to understand, actually. <laughs> if I, like, push that... Okay, yeah, that's like that. Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. I need, basically, to align them so that it's, like, green... Uh, blue, green, red on that row. Got it. I understand everything about the universe. I think I've gone and messed up. No, I haven't. Yeah, no, I haven't. That's it! Ah, <laughs> oh, that was looking very impossible for a very this long may time. Be it. But I forgot that if there's more than one in a row, then they'll all move, so yay! Skills! Even the totem heads are all happy. Look at them bouncing around like they're, they're demanding ritualistic sacrifices. Oh, you cute little totem boy. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yeah. <laughs> you also sneaked it in when I wasn't looking. Is it that desperate to get me into puzzles? I refuse to like puzzles. I'm Professor Layton. What do you take me for? Good lord. Some kind of puzzle man? This is insane. I found a crayon drawing. Leighton just wants to draw. Leighton just wants to sit in his room, listen to emo music and draw. That's all he wants to do. <laughs> Whatever. I think we've got everything in this room anyway. So, now we're going to move on. Back to... Actually, is there anything in here that we could possibly do? Talk to? Like, maybe you? Maybe you have a little bit of a puzzle for me? Just maybe? <sighs> okay. It's okay, really. So you can give me a puzzle. Man, the, the entire, like, my entire family's obsessed with puzzles. My, my, all my friends are obsessed with puzzles. See, it's just peer pressure. That's the only reason Leighton got into puzzles. It's just peer pressure. Four golfers named Mr. Black, Mr. White, Mr. Brown, and Mr. Blue were competing in a tournament. The kid didn't know who was who, so he asked three of the four. One of them, Mr. Brown, told her a lie. Shouldn't lie, Mr. Brown. It's not on. One of these is a lie. <laughs> okay. So, we got four people. Let's get let's get out of memo mode. Uh, B is Mr. Black. If we assume that's true, then B is Black. B is not Mr. Blue. Well, we know that B is not Brown. So B is either laptop. Stop it, laptop. I'm just having some slight technical difficulties here. There we go. So B is either black or white. Uh, C, Mr. White, that's D. So he might be white. But wait, if he's... If D is white, then C... Then B must be black. Uh, which means that C must be the liar, which means that D is... Oh, D's definitely not white. What? Yeah, no, that's right. That's right logic. If D is white, then B must be black. But that would mean that C is brown, which means that D's not white. So that's a contradiction. So D can't be white, which means that C is brown. So C is lying, A is telling the truth, B is Mr. Black. Wait, no, I'm not trying to find who's Mr. Black. <laughs> I'm being an idiot. Which means that that's white and that's blue. No, yeah, yes, yes. D! I think this may be it. Okay. Puzzle Logic for <laughs> That actually wasn't that bad. Like Mr. Brown is to see. Yes, I already worked that out. Using the power of circular logic. I don't even like puzzles, Dad! Stop trying to get me into the family business! God! <sighs> my father, my parents hate me! I'm running away from home! <laughs> Actually, no, I'm not. I'm going back home. It's, it's cold out here. I need to go back home. Father! Father, talk to me! I don't know why I'm talking to you. Uh, I should get that bomb of encouragement. Okay. Mother, tell father to stop it. No, don't you give me puzzles too. No. Both my parents hate me. Yeah. Fine, I'll look at this apron. 
Oh, that's just a pretext for looking at the puzzle, isn't it? That's just a pretext for looking at the puzzle. <laughs> I filled up my dear old apron in three different ways. It makes the flower pattern look different each time. What will the pattern look like when I unfold the apron? The, the apron, apron, apron. That's a mighty fine question there, Jimmy. So if we assume, like, that B is like folded. Oh no no no! Wait, it's it's definitely folded uh, in a certain way, right? Yeah, that way it's folded so that it's on the back. So that's so that's right for now. But it must also be folded like that. I'm getting confused again. I'm getting confused again. Okay. B is like that, right? Where the straps are, the straps are there, and behind there, I think. So if that's the case, then that's like that side. So that's B. Uh, yeah, I should probably have used a clear old button there, but I don't care. So C, is it folded? Where's C folded? That's a mighty fine question there, Jimmy. Where is C folded? I don't get this. I know it's wrong. I know it's stupid. I don't understand how C's folded. Like, the straps aren't helping. I don't get the straps at all. But I'm gonna say that. And if it's wrong... No, it is wrong. It's gotta be wrong. Because it doesn't make sense, does it? Well, it kind of does, but whatever. Here goes. This is, this is wrong. Puzzles can be quite. Fun. How the hell was A folded? <laughs> you can't tell what part you're looking at by which, by where the apron straps are because the drawing style in this game does not let you see that. <laughs> game. <laughs> and I, I, you know what? I got it right, but I still disagree. That, that doesn't get you off the hook, game. I still disagree. My parents hate me and they just try and make me look at puzzles all day. I'm leaving home. I'm leaving home. I am leaving home. Stop making me talk to you, mother. Stop it. Zoom out. Back to map. Leave. I'm running away from home. My parents clearly hate me. They just want me to do freaking puzzles all day. You puzzles. You there! You don't have a puzzle for me! Oh my god, you have a puzzle for me! Damn it! Everyone! Mr. Collins, he wants to give me more homework. Just because I ran into him out of school. This is illegal, I think. I don't know. It's probably illegal. <laughs> Stop giving me more homework! Blah. This is not school time! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I don't explore wants to go from point one to point five. To do so, he must pass through the correct four caves. Oops, there we go. Uh, he has four photos, A to D, taken by an explorer who made it through successfully. Work out the correct route using the photographs. Keep in mind you don't know which photo was taken where. <sighs> Is that really my only clue? It's not that helpful of a clue. <laughs> I thought that's a terrible. Uh, this does not help in the slightest. Well, let's assume B is taken at position five, and that means we have to go that way, I guess. <sighs> this. Is that really supposed to be able to work this out? How? Just climb over it. It's much easier. Uh, well, okay, no, 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 no. Actually, it's fairly... Okay, D must have been taken at point three, so that's got to be that one. Now it's just A and C to figure out. And of the two, they're both, like, from the right tunnel, so blue and blue? At least they both look like they're from the right tunnel. 
Let's go, I guess. I think this may be it. Looks as if I got it. You know what, guys? I don't know how I'm getting through these puzzles. <laughs> I don't know how I'm getting through these puzzles. I swear I've never seen these puzzles ever in real life, ever. <laughs> Sheer blind luck is all I can attribute this to. <laughs> I'm gonna be totally honest. <laughs> 